more than 70 pieces of oil paintings, traditional Chinese paintings, as well as photos, are shown at the painting exhibition titled Love Without Boundaries. Speaking at the opening ceremony, Jerusalem Mayor Nir Barkat said that he was deeply honored that the exhibition was being held in the heart of Jerusalem. He said when Nazi Germany and its allies decided to wipe out the Jewish people from this world, only a few places in the world helped Jews survive the terrible Holocaust and the cruelty of Nazi Germany. We remember very, very well how the Chinese government in Shanghai practically saved 20,000 Jews from the hands of Nazi Germany. Shanghai was safe haven for Jews through one of the toughest, worst, evil times our history can remember. Sponsored by the Shanghai Chinese Jewish Cultural Foundation, Shanghai Jewish Refugees Museum, and the Jerusalem International Convention Center. The exhibition illustrates how jewels fly to Shanghai during the World War II, as well as different scenes of their life in Shanghai. In his speech, Minister Counselor of the Chinese Embassy in Israel, Lu Kun, said both the Chinese people and Jewish people had experienced great suffering during World War II and commemorating what happened 70 years ago reflected the common aspiration of the two peoples to seek lasting peace. Among the visitors were some of the Jewish refugees who fled to Shanghai during World War II. They were very moved when they saw the paintings and photos on display. During the Second World War and the Chinese people were wonderful to us. I will never forget them. Zimmerman and her family fled Germany to Shanghai in 1938 when she was eight years old. They lived in Shanghai for more than eight years and left for the United States in 1947. Zimmerman recalled that Chinese people, poor or rich, were very nice to Jewish refugees, and a Chinese gentleman who surnamed Wu assisted her family a lot, helping her father stand on his feet during those hard days. The exhibition will last for 16 days.